Well, <clears throat> okay. in trouble no AC fault you see and that should also see on the nuts here as well and you can see emergency lights are working you can see right here bright emergency lights there's your remote unit so there's that and there's that um there's that Anyway, so let's uh, get started. So here's the panel in trouble. You can kind of see that. We got a Bosch F220 uh, smoke. We have the. Um... Hey guys, this is the way I uh, two alarms. Uh, voiceover. So, a few things to note. This is a simulated power outage, power outage, and not a real one. So, yeah. And also, if you noticed that there's a green cord coming out from the closet near the motion detector, near the uh, near the motion detector, to the uh, bundled up near the touchscreen keypad, uh, just ignore that for now. Um, that's actually going to be for the new panel. So, if you've been if you've been following my uh, been following me on Instagram or uh, or you're on my Discord server, you may actually know what it is at the. At, you may actually know what it is, but I'm actually not going to spoil it, spoil it here on YouTube. Just, uh, you know, just let you know that, yeah, a new panel is coming and it's going to replace the homemade one. So, yeah. Hey, you guys are wondering, how is this being powered? How is this still being powered? Well, it's actually a UPS that's actually powering the, uh, the fire alarm panel, the mo powering the fire alarm panel, um, the homey panel, it's powering it from a UPS. That's pretty much it for that's pretty much it for battery backup actually, so um yeah. System sensor S no P C two W L E D horn strobe. I actually am filming on my Samsung phone because my Pixel gets my Pixel uh phone gets way too hot and reduces uh, reduces uh, frame rates so I uh, can't do anything about that but I'm using the Samsung for now we got a uh, we got the um, MEG 12L still here we have a system sensor SW remote strobe uh, spectral advance and the um, 2424 smoke detector there's the emergency light and there's the exit sign. They're all the emergency mode. We have the um, we have the FCI MS2 pull station. We have a we have a system sensor 5451 heat detector, um, which it replaced a CMN CT11, which it died, which stopped working. So we got this one instead, and it's on a four-wire base. We have a system sensor SRLED remote strobe. We have the uh, rear index pull under the uh, mini stopper, and we have the um, and that's here, which is on trouble. Um, we got a system sensor. P2RH-LF. We got the I3. So, yeah. So. Okay. 
So there it is. Let's get started on testing the smoke detector. The F220. See so our alarm silence now, and you can see I have a zone one alarm. You go ahead and uh, reset it from the panel. Two wire level silence. So, the reason why I'm actually filming, uh, filming on my S9, the Galaxy S9, because the Pixel. Uh, Pixel Pixel 7a gets way too hot and reduces uh, frame rates. Frame rates, but yeah, see, it went back into trouble because there's no AC still. Acknowledge that. So there's the uh, panel. There's the panel. What looks like it's in trouble or no AC fault. And now we're gonna go ahead and activate the NS2. Before our time runs out, because yeah. This emergency light here lights up the pulse station here very perfectly. The emergency light. Okay, we got a zone three alarm. I'm gonna reset it here. Pain to reset, but uh, okay, and we'll reset it from here. Okay. All right, should go back into trouble. There it goes. There we go. And reset the pole station here. This is the rain X pole. Reset. Okay. Okay. So now we're gonna do the uh, the NBG twelve L. Whoa! Out of focus. Takes a while for the sync model to silence it, but yeah, there we go. Two wire elbow silence. Merge lights still going. Uh, just to let you know, this is a simulator outage. So yeah, UPS is running out of battery. Well, actually, no, it's still good. 
Got a little battery capacity still left on it. Anyway, this is that. There's the emergency light. There is the front strobe. The um, system sensor SR LED. So yeah. As you can see, I have a down to alarm. So we're gonna go ahead and reset that. And here is the um, PTR HS LF and two wire level silence. We're gonna reset. Okay, watch it, go, watch it come back to system trouble. There it goes. And it's getting hot in here too. Oof. It's starting to sweat. Anyway. <laughs> so there's that. So no AC fault, you can see. So now we'll go ahead and test the um Okay, so I'm gonna test the 2424. Here's the emergency light and here's the detector. Perfect sync. Alright. Okay, there's that. There's that. We'll reset. And then now we're going to go ahead and test, last but not least, the um, 5451, which I'm going to magnet test it, magnet test it, because, yeah. Oh. Wow, did that UPS just shut down? Yes, it did. Look at that. Okay, well, that's not good. We're running out of time. This should be the last one here. I want to go ahead and test the... Uh, the uh, thing just restart all of a sudden but wow this thing just rebooted all of a sudden weird power I just power power outages are weird let me tell you something so we'd have audible silence you can see now so yeah kind of see it. it's there they're in sync this thing is all messed up look at that it's all messed up. It's power edges are weird. I'm gonna reset. And I think that's it. I wanna go ahead and okay. Okay. So that's it for this test. Um <clears throat> there'll be a new panel. I'm not going to tell you which one it is, so stay tuned for that.
Stay tuned for our finale of the Fire Eliminator 800 DLPS. So, it'll be replaced with a new panel. If you've been following my Discord, my Discord server for a while, you may know what it is. But, I'm not going to spoil it on YouTube. Because uh, you want to know what it is. Actually, you know, yeah, yeah, you don't know what the model or brand of the panel is. But stay tuned for a finale of the homemade panel because it, it's going to be it's going to get replaced. It's been uh, five years, probably five or maybe six years. This thing has been over four years, maybe around five now. But since I built in and. Um, and updating it every time, but it's gonna get replaced. You can see. So, yeah, that's it for this system test. Um, the UPS just died here because, yeah, it just died. So I'm gonna go ahead and um, so I'm gonna go ahead and um, so this is a simulated outage. You can see all the emergency lights here. So this bright emergency light. This thing's so bright. How bright this thing is blinding and self-diagnostic you see there's your remote head so yeah that's it for this test um hope you guys enjoyed this video and yeah thank you for watching